Good morning, we just got our updates, so I wanted to show you what we do. Um, here's yesterday's graph of, uh, so we got uh, one ready, 511 knot, and we just try and track these numbers uh, just to see how it, you know, the data changes. As long as we're tracking consistently, these numbers should keep going in the right direction. So we should see this 60 being lower today. Uh, this 45, this 156 down here, this should be up today. Uh, everything seems to be moving in the right direction um, so far. Uh, that said, um, we go to our APIs page and we'll see that we got um, our updates for master zip codes. So we will go ahead and start processing. Uh, oops, oh, our zip code data, and it takes um, it takes a good minute to process this data. Um, what we're doing is pulling down um, every zip code's current in number of cases. So if you ever wanted to know just how much time we spend working on this, this is about how long it takes just to get the first page to load. All right, here we go. All right, so we've processed all of our zip codes. Got it done. Uh, so now if we actually load this, these should all be blanked out because we have, right. So no data. We're gonna go ahead now and um, let's pick a, Parkville. Okay, so we'll start with Parkville, and uh, it looks like you know their 45-day curve right across the top is coming down. That's what we want to see. Um, unfortunately, the seven-day curve is also still coming up. The seven-day curve is coming up at a rate that's different than the 45-day coming down. Welcome to math. Alright, so at this point, let's go ahead and just kick this off. And we're going to go ahead and let this process through all of the zip codes. All right, now that we've finished that, we're going to drop back uh, out of what hopefully would be a compressed video. Um, we're currently at 53 minutes of processing, and we're ready to go ahead and check the spike monitor now. Um, well, okay, these numbers are what they are. So you get your seven day increasing is 90. So what is 90? 90 is the seven day percentage has gone up uh, over 50%, over 30%, over 20%, over 10%, and under 10%. So these are all percentages that are going up. 
if you wanted to actually see the underlying numbers, uh, we can come back over to the uh, main dashboard. Uh, what you'll see is right here, we have our uptrend and our flat trend, which would be 106 counties trending up. And it tracks how many days they've been trending up. Same thing goes with flat trends. So depending on whether you're looking at uh, actual numbers of infections going up or percentages uh, coming down, they tell roughly the same view that it's totally different in different places. And that's the best we have right now. Um, so we'll keep monitoring these and if we see anything excessively concerning, uh, hopefully we'll see it here.